If you like this audio, please leave a comment, even if it's just an emoji. Thanks. And don't forget to turn on notifications so you know when I release a new audio. This audio features the guest voice talents of Yoshi. And let's set the scene. It's Halloween night. Your good friend came to your house to help you pass out candy to neighborhood children. Trick-or-treating time ended about an hour ago, and you've changed out of the cosplay you used to answer the door, and now you're just relaxing and catching each other up on news of people you know. There's a certain feeling in the air, though, and it's hard to put your finger on it. Whoa, 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 whoa. No way. You're lying. I would have never guessed. They've always been so... boring. Vanilla, even. Right? I mean, just... Mm. Halloween costumes for the general public shouldn't be that... raunchy, much less for the workplace. And someone definitely shouldn't confess to such a costume being from their, um, extracurricular activities. I guess I'm never going to their house again. <laughs> I swear, I have no idea how you dig up this stuff. You should be an investigator or, like, something. Just insane. You know, let's talk about something, mm, juicier. A little more gossipy. Like, I don't know, you. Oh, you know what I mean. How long has it been since you've been on a date? Or, I don't know, a hookup? Something? That's my point. I know you want something special, but how are you supposed to find someone when you're not even trying? You've got to, you know, go through the motions or whatever. There's plenty of fish in the sea. Oh, babes. That's not a plan. You need to make things happen for yourself. It's not like you can just rely on some, I don't know, magical Halloween event to just present you with the perfect man. Come on now. <laughs> right, you need to work at a... Oh! Did you see the lights just get really bright for a second? Hey, you look confused. Are you okay? Babe? Hey, honey? You. Stop there. Who are you? Why are you here? Yes, here, in these woods, at this hour. So foolish. You're not from here, are you? Your clothes are strange. It matters not. Come, we must get to town. Now, follow me. Oh, I am dangerous, but not to you. No more talk. Walk, now. My name is Rygar. I am what the locals call a night hunter. I track down and eliminate the demons that roam these woods, particularly on nights like tonight, when the moon is full and the mists swirl, and the shadows seem to just ease into your soul. Walk faster. Yes, demons. Are there no demons where you are from? Sounds like a paradise. No, we're not far. A few more minutes. We should be all right. I hope. I can feel them near, hear their teeth glittering in these nearby trees. Just hurry. Them. I 
kill them. I was doing so tonight, but I was returning because, because there are too many. The most I've ever taken down at once was two. More than that, I seek help. One bears little challenge at this point. They're horrible, snaggletoothed, dark beasts with black mists swirling their bodies. I... Every time I face one, it forces me to steady myself, to realize they can be killed, particularly by me. I've trained for this my whole life. Stay to my side. There's one following to our left. Yes. I'm sure of it. Don't stop. Keep moving. If we stop, it'll have an opportunity to... Shit. Just stay behind me. They do no fear. If they sense I'm a threat, it should stay... At bay. This one's not cowering. I... Another. And another. More. I. Listen, I will do what I can, but I. I fear this is the end. I, I'm sorry. I will attempt to, to distract them all. You must run that direction. It's only a few hundred more yards. If you can get within the town, the torches should, should scare them back. Tell them what happened here. Tell them... Tell them I tried. My foul beast. Run, run now. That light. Where, where are you going? Be safe. Hey, babe, hello? Whoa. You look like you've seen a ghost. Are you okay? Demon? I... Um, did you just have like a little stroke or something? You kind of just blinked out for a couple of seconds. You sure you're okay? You know I'm here. Okay... But... God, girl, don't scare me like that. Let's get something to drink. Forget about all this. What you got? Sure, that'll work. Trick-or-treating ended like an hour ago. Who the hell could that be? Oh my god. He is so hot. Hey there, I'm Ryan. I just moved in next door. I wanted to introduce myself to the new neighbors here. Do you live here? I'd like to right now, but... No, she does. Nice to make your acquaintance. I, I'm sorry, you look really familiar. Have we met before? I definitely feel like I know you from somewhere. Uh, hmm. Well, I'm glad to know you now. Yeah. Maybe, uh, we could go out and get better acquainted. Maybe tomorrow night? Yeah, sounds good. I'll, uh, I'll stop over at, uh, seven. Sure. There's something about this night tonight, isn't there? The full moon. It's almost kind of misty. Well, whatever. I'll see you tomorrow. Looking forward to it. 
<laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Take care.